Hello everybody, it's Beard Boy OG here and welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. And in today's episode, we are going to be working... Oh wait, if I could get my... There we go, we are going to be working on the horse stable. So if you remember in the last episode, I was talking about I really wanted to rebuild this, that's why I excluded it from the rest of our village. So today... Especially since we have a lot of saddles, I want to completely rebuild this and make it just look nicer. And I have a little pathway idea that I want to do. So I think that's going to look really cool. So that is what we're doing in today's episode. And yes, I know every YouTuber asks this, but could you please subscribe? Only about 30% of the active viewers on this channel are subscribed. And it would help uh, me, it would help you. It would help this community a lot if we can get it to grow. The goal is to get to about 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And I think we can legitimately hit that goal with the people that watch this channel. It is completely free, so you can do whatever you want. I don't want to force you, but it'd be great if you could subscribe. Now with the YouTube spiel underway and finished, what I'm going to do now is get the materials... Uh, set up. I think we can get a decent amount of materials just from this itself because there's a decent amount, but I know we're going to need more. So I might need to go uh, uh, hunting for items. So what I'm going to do, because I want to block these guys off. I don't want them gone. So we're going to tear this out. We're going to pretend like this water wasn't here. And what I'm going to do specifically is block these guys off. I could probably block them off by moving them back. I ha I think these guys are attracted to wheat. Are you? No, you are. Can you guys go the other way? This is the exact opposite of what I need. Yes. Good idea. Bring your friends over. Come on. This one decided not to leave, so, um, don't look. Oh, weird. This horse just totally despawned out of nowhere. I don't know why that happened. Okay, time to destroy this thing. So this shouldn't take me too long, because a lot of this is just materials that we can use to rebuild it in the way that I want. And it's definitely not the way it's built up now. This is ugly. What I'm going to do, it's the basic design you probably have all seen. So I imagine this is like a fence gate area. So they're going to have their own like 3x3 three three area. So something like this. Imagine this is like a wall or fence post or something like that. And it's going to go that room, that room, that room. We'll have it going up. It'll be spacious. They won't be trapped inside this like that. It's a design that, like, everybody has their own version of this design, but it's a design that everybody have, has seen. So, I'm confident this can go well. And it is nighttime, and there's not a bed in there. I don't want to be finding mobs. I realize he's out in the open. That's not good. Not good at all. You're scaring me, villager. Oh, I just let him... Yeah, you head this way. Yeah. You know what? <clears throat> nope. You come back. Don't maybe go craft a boat. You know what? I'm gonna go craft a boat. I'll be back. Haha, you've been trapped. Now I can force you to stay safe. You're with me now, buddy. Now, here another one of your buddies somewhere. I just don't know where they are. So, uh, yeah, you're gonna be safe over here. If I can turn this, turn. There we go. Now, to make sure uh, zombies can't get this guy. There, now they can't hit him. At least for now, so we're gonna cover that up there. Uh, that's good enough for now. 
So what I'm going to continue doing is stripping this down. I just stopped to sleep and save his life. He owes me now. And after this, I think I'm going to come up with the design that I want to do for the overall build. I think it's going to be just regular oak and oak fences. I think we're going to keep this simple. Guys, let's be honest. I don't use this. I'm not going to use this enough for to make it complex. But I'm going to use it enough where we can go on adventures, which soon we're going to have some adventure episodes because I really haven't done that in the series yet. We went caving a lot. We've built stuff a decent amount. For some reason, I have not built anything yet. So, we're going to get that started here in the future. But first, we need to get these guys a place to sleep. A place where they can be put away. So we don't have to worry about them dying. So, yeah, I'm going to get this finished. And I'll be back. Okay. So we got this completely, completely removed. Now I'm going to go over, I'm going to go get some wood and I think I'm going to go mine some cobblestone because I want to go, I want to make stone brick for the roof. Well, part of the roof. We have a lot of these oak stairs from the previous roof that I think would look good for a reuse. So I think I'm going to do a mixture of the two. So basically... The first layer, so like this layer here, would be the stone outlining everything, and then everything else would be the oak wood. I think that's what I'm going to do for the uh, outline of the roof. That is the best thing I think that can go on, and then I'm going to use regular oak fences for the uh, fencing, because I think that's just going to look nice by default. I think there's like, it's not too difficult to make a good looking... Horse stable, I'd say. That's what I'm trying to say here. Also, while I'm going to go mine some wood, I cannot wait for the 1.19 update to come out. There's a lot of really cool stuff we'll be able to do with this world when that update rolls around. Like, there's so much that's about to happen. The Warden. That is going to be such an interesting fight. Like, you can't even say fight, because he's not meant to be fought. But that is interesting, and I think really soon I'll be updating this world to the newest update, because they're getting close anyway, if you know what I mean. They're getting really close to the end of the 1.19 development cycle. We could legitimately see 1.19, I'd say, within... A few weeks to a month, a couple months, somewhere around there. Because once you start adding advancements in the music, uh, discs and music, at that point, you're about done, which sads me because I want to see these kind of forest, birch forests with those tree mushroom uh, things. I think that's just either being scrapped or development on that is just ended. Which makes me sad, because I really wanted to see that in the game. That was something I was really hoping for. But sadly, they're canceling that, it seems like. But, it seems like this update, anyway, is going to be a... More of a bug fix update, kind of like the Buzzy Bees update from a few years back. Which, after working on the Nether, and then working on the massive project that was the caves and cliffs updates and that's plural and the fact they're putting so much work into the uh to the end ci uh, not end cities but the deep dark cities that we're going to be getting like i can't be mad at how long it's taking and how little we'll get in everything else because it's the wild update but like you could argue well what's wild about it you know actually like those We'll throw those out. There we go. But I can't wait for it to come out, because I'm thinking probably when the... I think we're going to get the first pre-release soon. Once that comes out, that's probably when I'm going to be updating this world to the 1.19 update, and I think we're going to do some stuff with the Warden soon. Not too soon. <laughs> Don't get that twisted. I'm not looking to die yet. I have a lot of stuff on me, and I don't think I'm ready for... I don't think I'm ready for that. 
but there's a lot of stuff like frogs, frog lights are going to be cool. I'm really going to use those frog lights a lot. Because I am somebody that likes those kind of design elements and those blocks. And I think it's going to be a lot easier for me right now to get those than getting a... Uh, what is it? Uh, God, I know the... What are... Uh, sea lanterns! There we go. It'll be a lot easier than sea lanterns. Okay, we're about to be fighting. You guys get to see a fight. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Who? Ow. Yeah. Ah. There we go. You guys got to see a fight. Okay, I'm back with materials. And I have a basic layout of what I want this to look like. So these are just here. So they give me a just general view of what I want to do. So they're going to be three by three locations just like this. Uh, in each, we're going to have these pop up everywhere. That will be fixed here momentarily. Can I get that? There we go. So there's going to be three rooms. We're going to have this one. We're going to have that one. We're going to have that one. We're going to have that one access accessible from that way. We have three animals. We have a cow, so we might as well throw the cow here or just grab a donkey from over there and we can put them there. And then the other two horses, because they're going to be more used, I think we can put in these two. Oop, pressed the wrong button. So, what I'm planning. So, there's two things that I want to try. So, I want to try both looks. So, this end right here, where that was, that's where these are going to go. So, we're going to start going one, two, three. So, we need them to be able to go in. So if we have this here, we need to be able to jump. So I think we need to be able to, I think we need four. I think four up is the level we're going to want. And we're just going to slowly add in spots. So it's nine by nine right now, but we did have stuff in the way in spots where we wanted to put stuff. So oop, there, there. So yeah, something kind of like this is what I'm going to try to build. So I'm going to try to fill each one of these spots out like that and try not to have them escape. And I'll come back with you once I have some progress done. Okay, I'm back with an update. So instead of doing the oak fences like I was originally planning, I switched over to oak, or not oak, cobblestone walls because I think this kind of looks better. Legitimately, I think this looks better contrasting to that. I think this is going to look better. So we have all three sides built. Now it's time to work on the wall. Or wall. The ceiling. So for the ceiling. We're obviously going to need. A lot of stairs. Uh, for the outline. And then we're also going to have an outline. Or not outline. But most of it in this. So outside of the outline, which will be somewhere here, not exactly there, but cobblestone will be the outline, oak, oak stairs will be the filler, and then on the inside, we're going to do a little bit, Ooh, if I could click correctly, of this. So it looks like it's aging a little bit. So we're going to have a little bit of birch in there as well. To make it look like it's aged a little bit. Because I want to try doing stuff that I don't usually do. So, I'm going to start this, let's say, bop, like that. We do something a little different. So we keep that one, because that could stay there. But then we can't get to our guys. So yeah, I think we're going to start on this level. And go around. Yeah, I think this is going to be the best idea anyway. I'm trying to get these go. And then there's that problem. Okay. I got to figure this out, but I'll come back with an update. Okay, so now I'm on to the second level, which we're going to do oak wood for that. So just simply go around with oak wood. I'm going to do multiple levels with this. Uh, and then focus on the detail levels. I'm not going to do any cobblestone slabs with this one. Or cobblestone. I mean oak slabs, because I don't think it needs it, because this is, we're trying to make it nice while also trying to make it a little old. That's, that's, what, that's what I'm trying to do. So, I'll come back once I have an update. 
Okay, we are on to the second to last step here. So this can be, at least for the outline and what it's be, uh, being built to be, is done. So now what I'm going to do is find random spots. Let's say right here, we place one there. Just try to do a little bit of texture. Just to make this look nice. Because texture always looks good. That's something that if you want something to look better, even if it's not the greatest build in the world. Just change the color to something that's similar in color. Change something that's similar in color to the block that you're using because it gives it a little bit of detail just by itself. I think adding a little bit of hay bales here to the side because they're going to be really cramped if we put them in there. I think to the side would be fine. So we maybe not there, but adding some over here on like the side just so we have a good little look. See, so like a little bit of that. Come on. Why aren't you? There we go. Is it? Oh, it's because it's moss. There we go. And we can have it like rotating around. Yeah, look at that. Looky there. There, and then let's put one there. I think that's going to work because it could show that we're feeding our horses. And for the most part, this is done. We have a little bit of uh, moss on the bottom just so they have a little bit of eatery and a little bit of a floor you know a little bit a little bit of a nice little thing here we have our little hay bales over everywhere and we have our little rooms now it's time to really just clean some of this up so like that spot is it just that spot really i don't believe that maybe it was just that spot okay then so i would consider this project done so i'm gonna add Oh, of course it does it now. Bam, there we go. We're just going to add some light fixtures everywhere. By that I mean torches. Just so it looks a little nicer with everything here. Not there. Like so. Oh, and I fell. Fine. There we go. We get that one. We place it there. Bam. Ooh, if I can reach. Bam. There we go. Now it's fully lit up. Now I'm going to work on the pathway down. It's going to be very simple. We are going to get our dirt blocks out. We're just going to mine out the spots where you want the road to be. So pop up. Pop up. And we're just going to head our way down. So this will take me just a moment. Because I have a plan for what I want to do. Okay, I am back. I finally finished this part. So I added a little bit of a water fountain. Slash boulder. Slash pond area over here. Which I think looks really nice. We'll add like lily pads when we get our hands on those. But... I should introduce our stairway up. I think it really looks nice. It's really easy, really fast to go down, and I like the little curviness it has. I really do. And we head up here, and we have the look of our lovely, and I mean it when I say our lovely, horse stable. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Survival Let's Play, consider subscribing. It helps out the channel. Consider liking. So liking always helps. And comment down below. Horse. Because we're going to be riding these horses. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye everybody.